All right, Pro Stock Motorcycle Pits, we're here with the master, the championship winning crew chief, Tim. Tim, what are we looking at here? We're looking at air fuel ratio. Tell me about this. This green line is air fuel ratio and the red line is engine RPM. So th the reason why we find fuel injection beneficial is because we can manipulate this line to get it to look however we want. We can we can sit on the dyno and figure out what what air fuel ratio the engine's making the most horsepower at. And we can come to the racetrack and we can emulate that air fuel ratio at every single RPM site. With carburetors, essentially you just have you can move this this entire line up or you can move the entire line down. But we can't change the air fuel ratio at the bottom of a gear versus the top of a gear. However, with fuel injection we can. So we can keep the motor working at its peak air fuel ratio, making the most power it possibly can at every RPM site. So I've heard people say in drag racing, carburetors are the way to go because wide open throttle is wide open throttle. What, how would you respond to that? It's really tough to make the peak horsepower that carburetors make. But when you're looking at trying to get a motorcycle to transition, down here at the bottom of a gear is closer to peak torque than up here. Well, this is this this area right here is more demanding for fuel. So we can give it the fuel that it needs to help move the motorcycle down and make the torque we want to make. Wow, that's awesome. This is every week, every race weekend for you looking at this, right? It is. And Jerry, is this why you're the champ? He's the reason I'm the champ. Awesome. I'm just on along for the ride. Thanks for the lesson, guys. Thank you.